And thank you for the, the support, um, Mike, on trying to, to move us to consistency. Um, I was hoping to get a slightly more clear answer from County Council because um, while I also, I mean, clearly think that the safe parking programs are critical and that we should be using every available tool that we have to combat homelessness, at, at the same time, I want to make sure that we are working through consistent processes that we all support and understand. Um, my reading of the of the policy uh, 3.26.1. Um, did not make clear to me that, that this request met any of those criteria. If, if council's opinion is, is different and that, this, um, and that this request is appropriate under that policy, then, then I will support it. Um, otherwise, I would rather not support it today, have us get to a place where we're really clear about what we as individual um, supervisors and uh, bring forward and in what form so that um, really so that we don't keep having the conversations. Let me clarify my comment. Um, I was answering the question of whether board policy 3.26 applied to this item. And I think the answer is on its face, yes. However, I also want to acknowledge that there is a um, uh, there has been inconsistent practice on the part of the board with respect to the treatment of referrals. So, so this, you're saying that, that yes, it applies the policy because applies. it's a CBO, but does it meet the criteria? Yeah, I wasn't answering the question as okay. to whether it met the criteria under the policy, so I apologize if that was confusing. And what is your opinion on the criteria? I, I agree and understand that it, that it does apply here. Yeah, so, so the, the the policy applies to any request for CBO funding off cycle. The right. criteria determination are those four factors uh, Supervisor Wasserman referenced, current contract. Uh, yes, I believe there's a current contract here. There is. Mm -hmm. um, you know, verifiable crisis uh, based on the legislative file. Um, I'm, I, it, it's not clear that there's but there maybe could be other information presented regarding that factor. Um, you know, pause a minute. You're saying the homeless issue is not a crisis after we declared an emergency here in the county so that we can build shelters under the state law? Is no. that what you're saying? No, that's not what I'm saying. The okay, sense, please sense, clarify at, at each point what your authority is for what you're saying, Council. So the, the sentence in Board Policy 3.26 is verifiable crisis, the CBO, must be on the verge of interruption or termination of services due to a verifiable financial or facility-related crisis. Um, so not in reference, obviously, to the, I think, universally acknowledged homelessness crisis, but with respect to the, the CBO. Um, the next factor is critical service, and the final factor is significant impact. Ultimately, however, the whether the criteria are met or not is not a determination is a determination to be made by the board not a determination to be made by um, you know, by county council it's not a legal question it's a policy question that there is a process set forward in that policy for that um, which is that the item would first go through FGOC um, you know, the, this policy has been around, but I acknowledge, and I think Supervisor Cortese's point is, is that the board hasn't been in practice um, bringing uh, these types of items necessarily forward uh, under policy 3.26. Maybe that's my best effort to answer the question. <laughs> 